Hey guys and girls, welcome back to Let's Play The Witch in the Hundred Night. Um, what's it going to be? Go. So we're back uh, on the 29th floor. Like I said, I was going to start from here. So you guys can see if there's a scene. Um, so we can see together, basically, if there's a scene on the 30th plus. Uh, I may have to get through the 30th floor, or I think. I, I, this is usually just the floor where you hit to go to the next level, though, I'm pretty sure. But, um... Yeah, this is gonna be a short part because we're just gonna we're just here to play the scene. I just want to see what exactly happens uh, when we find Alachino's body. So let's go next room. Ooh, that thing is sitting on his body. Hmm. Hey, Hundred Knight, isn't that thing under there Junk's body? I see. This thing is on top of the body and it's holding it down. <laughs> Let's break that thing and get his body back. Ooh, invalid? What? Witch soldier Regrima. In the middle. Holy crap. What do I hit him with? Does anything work? Okay, there we go. That's what I thought. Ow! Don't die. Don't die. Wow. You have a lot of those things. Huh. Alright, all right, get out of there. Ow! Run, 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 run. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> Holy crap, that was close. That was close. All right. Good night. Stupid monster. Whew. That, I think that was harder than it should have been for me. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Hunter Knight. Hey, you, Junk, we fulfilled your promise. Oh, my body. How many years has it been? Hey, dog, put his head on his body. Eh, all right, N like this? All right, like this? Oh, wonderful. It moves. Thank you very much, everyone. His body is back, but he still talks weird. It just returned. Doesn't mean it's fixed. Piece of junk is a piece of junk. Madam Witch Knight and the Hundred and Hundred Knight. Very fine work. Don't talk all high and mighty. Hey, do you remember you're my servant now? My pleasure. A favor shall be returned. Anyway. Ah, my body moves. I can walk as much as I want. This is wonderful. Why are you so happy about walking in this tower? Why happy? I don't know. Well, at least I won't get bored anymore. I can look outside the castle. Birds, animals, a forest, and a town. A town? How far do you think the nearest town is from here? Can you really see that far with your eyes? Yes, the life of the castle town and humans are very interesting. Laughing, crying, and getting angry. The monsters in here attack prey and wait. That's all. Boring, like me. Hmm? Anyway, who built you and for what reason? A long time ago, a witch made me to be her servant. I served her for a long time, but the witch disappeared. Where did she go? She was killed by humans. I see. That massive witch hunt, right? That's... Gosh. 
gosh, humans are ridiculous. Then again, there are many more witches that are ridiculous, but after all, humans and witches are an incompatible relationship. It's either hunt or be hunted. And no matter how powerful a witch is, the humans have numbers. Those witches who got hunted were weak witches, after all. I don't have a grudge against humans for that. So, dog, don't make that face. B but uh, I'm saying th these cruel things not because I hate the humans. It's simply because I look down on them. <laughs> However, you're not even close to being called a human. Eh. Me too. Grudge, anger, sadness, happiness, fun. Oh, wait, that's Arlecchino, my bad. I don't get it. I don't get it. <laughs> you don't have a grudge from your master's death. Seems like your master was a worthless evil witch, too. No, she was a very kind witch. What? My master flew me here into this tower with the last of her magic. From then on, over a few hundred years, I was wandering inside here doing nothing. I didn't have a reason to. There was nothing to do. But now Madam Witch has given me a new purpose. <laughs> That's right. Be grateful and serve me. From now on, your master is the splendid witch Leah. Remember it. My pleasure. Oh, thank you. You're so kind, Madam Witch. Huh? What? What did you say? Who's kind? A witch is self-centered and mean, and most of all free-spirited, and a burden for others, the worst kind of all. Listen, kind is not a compliment for a witch. It's offensive. Don't you ever say kind to me again. Do you understand me? My pleasure. Thank you. An order from my master. How long has it been? Madam Witch, you are so kind. Didn't you hear me? I just told you and you're already saying it. Hey, Junk, can you understand any of the words coming out of my mouth? Oh, ho, ho. Madam Witch cannot stand this magical creature. Uh, um, was it Arlecchino? I'm Visco. You don't look so scary now that you have your body. Nice to meet you. And I feel really bad about your master. Even though it's been over hundreds of years, I don't know why there was a witch hunt. Our kingdom's history was built with the witches and improved with them. No, Knight. I'm not concerned about about it. Hmm. You don't even want to take revenge for your master, you coward. If you say there's something wrong with it, then it's the same as the dog situation. I don't get humans. If you put it like that, then I have nothing to tell you. Gosh, anyway, 100 Knight and this piece of junk. Are there any magical creatures that can follow orders loyal loyally? I'm, I've been following orders like to the T. I am loyal. Master told me to stay here. That was my only orders. Staying in this mold-infested tower forever? <laughs> What's so nice about that? To the day when humans and witches can work together. Until then, I am standing by. Master has died, and I don't feel anything. Neither sadness nor loneliness. To begin with, I don't have a heart or feelings. Really? Then Hunter Knight is superior. He gets mad like a man. Superior? Hunter Knight? Then me? Uh, affirm? I don't want to say I'm superior. <laughs> but hey, I've been bullied a lot. I might as well. This Manania is a liar. <laughs> oh, it's really getting angry. See? Right? Are you mad now? Not really. Well, whatever it is, I get it now that you don't have emotions like happiness or sadness. <laughs> You're convenient for... He looked pretty happy when he got his body back. Alright, let's proceed. You'll be working for me as a luggage carrier to the top of this tower. Top? Tower? Why? I wanted the spell which was cast on my body lifted. By the way, Madam Witch, what is your wish that brings you to this tower? What? Why do I have to tell someone like you? You're right. I'm sorry for butting in your business. Spell. Spell. Lift. Wish. Why? What? You live in this tower and you didn't know? <laughs> There's a legend that if you reach the top of the tower, then any wish of yours will come true. Wish. Any. Wow. Hmm. I understand. I too will go with you. 
I have a wish. What? A magical creature has a wish? <laughs> Interesting. Tell me. Yes, I. Heart. Emotions. I want. Happiness. Sadness. Regret. I want to know feelings. What? What a human? Are you an idiot? Uh, you are an idiot. But you want a human heart. Do you know what those nice humans did to your master? And yet you want a human heart. That is just dumb. You're not just an idiot, but a piece of scum. You, you didn't have to say that much. Well, anyway, your knowledge about witches may come in handy. Alright, let's go and don't slow me down. My pleasure. You know what this is giving me vibes of? Like a twisted Wizard of Oz. Because we're climbing the tower, we're meeting a new person every so few levels. It's like the yellow brick road. Um, you know, he's the tin man that wants a heart. She's the lion who, um, I guess, you know, courage wouldn't be this like the safe bet to say for her. But she, you know, she can take the pace of the lion because she's a pup. Um, then you have um, Leah, who we don't know what she wants, but she's a witch. And witches are like the main place in the Wizard of Oz story. And then I guess that would make me Toto. Maybe. I don't, or Dor I mean, you could say I'm Dorothy. I don't, I don't know. Hey, look, stairs. The big monster that was on top of Junk was the guardian of this floor. Or you could say that, that, uh, that, um, the, pu the puppy girl is, uh, Toto. Leah would be Dorothy. And then we have a tin man, and then we have me. Uh, as the, um, the line, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just, I'm just put, trying to put things together a little bit. We killed two birds with one stone. Is this because of my good karma? Don't you think so, Hunter Knight? <laughs> a convenient interpretation. How nice. How funny. I helped you, so why are you saying such rude comments? You piece of junk. You have quite an attitude. I want to see the face of your master, but she's probably deep below Earth. <laughs> I bet her bones and ashes are rotting away with garbage. You're right. You should at least feel a little angry, you piece of junk. That is why I'm going to wish for it. Oh yeah, now I kind of feel like I want to help you. I want you to gain some emotions and make a sad face and see you stomp the ground in frustration. Oh, how nice of you. You're so kind, Madam Witch. <laughs> Damn it! How many times do I have to tell you? Ah, you piece of junk. All right. So the the next area is open. Um, let's return to base for now, cause I am kind of hurt. And then we'll see if there's a scene when we when we re uh, enter this area. And then, as per usual. Uh, We'll come back um, when I'm at the top of this part. What is that? Oh, I can gather on the floor. What's wrong, dog? Did you find something already? 
I'll give you a bone for your reward. I don't want a bone. Ugh, no. There's something shiny over there. From the looks of it, it's a jewel or something. A treasure? <laughs> now that's what I'm talking about. It's not just an ordinary jewel. If this tower is filled with mana, then it might be a rare gem with a spell on it, right? But Madam Witch, it's okay if it's magic, but what if there's a curse on it? Don't worry about such insignificant matters. Now let's see. A pendant? Hmm. Huh. Th this is... No way. But this was surely... What's wrong, Madam Witch? You look so serious all of a sudden. What? Oh, it's nothing. Don't worry. Just give me that right now. E yeah, okay. Here you go. Oh no! The Tar Witch! What? What is this? An enemy raid. Crap, dog. Bite them and slow them down. Don't, don't be ridiculous. What happened? The pendant just... What? She stole it. I can't believe that. Oh, stupid tar witch. Oh ho ho. How are you weaklings? What? You. Who are you? Oh, I'm the tar witch, Teresa. Remember that. <laughs> My pleasure, madam witch. You piece of junk. Don't greet her. Oh, uh, witch? Is it real? As expected, there are still some witches here. Hmm, your appearance kind of seems like a witch. <laughs> you have the stink of a novice, but at least you look like a witch. <laughs> I'm the splendid witch, Leah. Don't talk to me like that. Hey, thief, give me that pendant back. Pendant? I was wondering why you held it so religiously. But this is just a cheap pendant. I don't care about it, but if you want it back, then... Just kidding. I'm not going to give it back. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Hey, you piece of crap. If you don't want to get killed, then give me that back right now. Mm, kill me? You? <laughs> How funny. If you can, then be my guest. I'm not someone that gets killed by a half-baked witch like you. Half-baked? You? No, Madam Witch, please calm down. And you don't have to be that belligerent to begin with. But come on, let's just talk. What? Isn't she the one that tried to pick a fight with me? Um, was it Tarwitch? May I ask one thing? Was it you who cast this curse on me? Huh? Uh, no. What are you talking about? If not, then I apologize. Or if you know the witch that cast the curse on me... Hey, don't be so polite to an enemy, you coward. No, but it's too early to determine if she's an enemy yet. Curse on you? I don't have any time to cast curses on a human and come to this tower. I may not look busy, but I actually am. <laughs> no, you wanted to get out, but you just couldn't. <sighs> what did you say? You probably ran away from the witch hunt and hid in this tower, you coward witch. Hey, dog, you said you haven't seen any witches over the past few hundred years, right? Yeah, you were the first witch I've seen in my in my life, and this girl is the second one. Girl? A girl? You're talking to me like that, even though you know who, how old I am? Uh, um, t sorry. Like I said, don't be such a coward, you worthless dog. Worthless dog is just too cruel. And, uh -huh. I smell humans from this half-baked witch. Yeah, since you're half-baked, you're probably half-human. <laughs> She's half-human? Really? What? From the look of it, you're a novice that's only lived for maybe ten years or so. What a splendid witch you are. Wow. The, the Metalia is way in the future. So, so this is her when she, like, just... 
be, like broke out as her own witch. Really? Could it be that Madam Witch, you're no different than me? Why do I have to tell that to you? Anyway, this is your last warning. Give me that pendant back right away. No way, never. If you want it, then why don't you fight for it back? Wow, to see her outdo Metallia is kind of like shocking me a little bit. <laughs> Crap! Hey, Donk, Donk, Hundred Knight, split up and go find her. My pleasure, Madam Witch. M me too? <laughs> if you're in danger, then bark and I'll come right away. Now go search for that stupid witch thief. Gosh, I've become soft. I shouldn't have warned her and just killed her from the beginning. Well, um, I will see you guys on the next part, um, where we will be on floor 39, and, um, possibly facing off against the Tar Witch at this point. That's the only thing I can, I can think of. Uh, we'll have to battle, right? Unless she's gonna run to, uh, the Duchess again. The Duchess of this world, or whatever. But anyway, guys, I'll see you then. Bye-bye.